the Osage Beach community is coming together to support the police department and the family of a fallen officer. Felicia Carson had been on the force for just over a year when she died during a police chase early Saturday morning. Color 10's Carissa Codell was in Osage Beach today learning more about the officer's impact on the community. Officer Carson's favorite color was pink, and that's why friends, family, and community members have come here to the Osage Beach Police Department to lay down pink flowers. Uh, it just rubs at your heart. David Langley has lived in Osage Beach for eight years. It's horrible. It's horrible. He tells me the community here cares about first responders, raising nearly $10,000 for Carson's family in the last 24 hours. To lose somebody like this is worse than a tragedy. It just rips at the heart of the community. But as you can see, the community cares a lot. Police say Officer Carson was trying to pull over Christopher Waymeyer just after 1.30 a.m. on Saturday. He didn't stop, and Officer Carson chased him westbound from Highway 54 to Highway A. That's when her patrol car ran off the road, hit a tree, and caught fire. These wonderful people serve our community, and uh, actions of one individual took a life. Waymeyer is now facing charges of resisting arrest and creating a substantial risk of death. What he did was wrong. What happened was a tragedy. He's at fault, so I think he should pay the price. Officer Carson leaves behind a husband and six children. We have a very safe community, and a lot of it has to do with their care of the community. Funeral arrangements have been made for this Thursday starting at 11 a.m. at the Lodge of Four Seasons. There will be a procession and her funeral will have full police honors. Reporting in Osage Beach, I'm Carissa Codell, Color 10 News.